Shamisa, the leader of the CCC, advises career politicians to start their own parties and rejects them. Citizens Coalition for Change CCC leader Nelson Chamisa has expressed his distaste of professional politicians within his party and said that if they are unhappy with his style of leadership, they could start their own political organizations. Chamisa made it clear that his party is not a good place for career politicians during a session with CCC members in the Mashinaland East province that took place at Mbuya Nahanda Hall in Marandra. He advised anyone seeking office to think about starting their own political parties. He said, Let me advise those who want positions start your own party. Nobody will ever establish a party that is more powerful than the CCC. Known for his fiery political approach, Chamisa is presently traversing the nation to meet with provincial chief executives and get updates on the recently held harmonized elections. The leader of the CCC has been contesting the results of the elections, which were held on August 23 to 24, and Emerson Numingagua of the ZANU PF party was declared the victor. The opposition group led by Chamisa argues that fraud marred the elections and is calling for new ones to be held. Opponents claim that Chamisa favors youthful activists over senior party members. He did, however, make it clear that leadership is not just about academic knowledge but also about knowing what the masses want and need. Chamisa stressed that prior beliefs held within the now-defunct MBC party are irrelevant to the current system because the CCC is an organized citizens movement driven by the interests of the people. Chamisa continued to show his lack of concern by saying there is no rush to organize an election congress for the CCC. He countered the idea that the CCC lacks an official structure by emphasizing the party's successful election of mayors, council members, and MPs. As proof of their existence, he gave examples of leaders from Goramanzi in South Africa. Despite facing challenges like state institutions supporting the incumbent government, allegations of involvement from groups like FAZ Forever Associates Zimbabwe and traditional leaders aligned with the ruling party. Chamisa claimed that defeating the ruling ZANU-PF party was a difficult task and credited the support of the people for their success in the election. Even though the Southern African Development Community SADC Election Observer Mission Report found that the Zimbabwean elections were not free, credible, or fair and did not meet local, regional, or international standards, Chamisa expressed his conviction that divine intervention would still occur even if SADC chose not to step in. With his comments, Chamisa made clear the CCC's position on career politicians and his resolve to run the party in his own way with the goal of bringing about political change in Zimbabwe.